So, sisters and brothers, something that I have acknowledged in the news today, this morning, um, is that there is an alleged rise on um, what am I trying to say here? Uh, people killing people with guns? Yeah, what's new? What's new under the sun? Nothing is new under the sun, I'll tell you that much right now. Right now would be a good time to invest yourself in maybe a, an assault rifle. Um, if you're looking for a good uh, pistol, Glock makes a great pistol, so does Smith & Wesson, two of my favorites, <laughs> for sure. Um, yes, but I would recommend investing in, assault, in an assault rifle, um, AKs and ARs. What, I wanna know down in the comments below, what do you think's a better rifle, AK or an AR? I tend to like the Kalashnikov better, the Russian version of the AK-47, the original. No fingers being pointed back at me. But I also like the SKS, and I also really don't know too much. I know a lot about it. I just never shot one, an AR-15, and they're very accurate. They are very accurate <laughs> compared to the Kalashnikov. However, um, right now, with all these uh, alleged gun bans and, uh, and all these, first of all, <laughs> I'm gonna tell you a little something about, <sighs> now shout out to Russia, because Russia has warned Americans time and time again, don't give in to the propaganda machine. The propaganda machine meaning the news outlets. So when you see a lot of these uh, mass shootings, some are real, some are fake. Now I could tell I could go really deep with this, but it's not necessary. Uh, under the, our Constitution, it says that we have the right to bear arms against a tyrannical government. Now it's up for you to decide if the government's tyrannical, but I think a lot of people are starting to think and believe that the government is. Now I'm going to tell you. Let's get into the vaccines for one second. The vaccinations. Vaccinations, if you okay, in the original flu vaccination, what they put is in mercury. Mercury is a heavy metal, which actually really slows your body down. Uh, spoke about this in one of my videos about uh, <laughs> they're here. Um, spoke about this in one of my videos, anyways. The reason, the only reason why the government would try to try to ban uh, rifles and as they say, long guns, they have no idea what the fuck they're talking about, is because they want the public to be defenseless when they decide they want to go in and implement something like martial law. And there was an experiment done, okay? See, I know things. And this experiment was in Massachusetts, it was the, um, the marathon, that's right, it's not, a mar it's not a race, it's a marathon. It was the, it was the, it was the, the, the marathon bombings. And the experiment was this, all right, shout out to ASAP because I, he did a good video, or the producer who produced the video was, did a fucking incredible job of explaining, uh, in the end, don't fuck with the American people. And um, what am I getting at? So right now, obviously, we're going through some troubles, troublesome times. And it's up for you to decide if it's a tyrannical government, but um, shout out to Edward Snowden. I listened to one of your videos yesterday. As a matter of fact, I had a dream about you, which I thought was kind of weird. Uh, shout out to Washington as well. Um, I, had, I had a very vivid dream last night, and uh, a lot of these shootings are fake. To be quite honest with you, there you go, I said it. A lot of them are fake. Believe it or not, they are. Um, so, now you know, you might want to invest yourself in a piece. And I would recommend a rifle. So, I live in Florida. We bear arms down here. That's what we do. Texas, shout out to Texas. Also, they bear arms. Um, you see, the Democrats, they don't quite understand that they are not upholding the Constitution in the way that 
before I get cut off here is the way that I understand now much better is the corporations working with the government um, is basically stepping all over our constitutional freedoms and that's that's just the way it is and I want and I want to give a huge shout out again to the veterans always especially the ones that have specifically died but also the ones who fought for our freedoms this is the right reason why people take their freedoms for granted every day don't it's serious man and things are about to heat up on this picture the planet on fire picture that because it's something something is coming and they've been i'm not gonna say it but let's just say potentially it could be worse than 9 11 could you imagine yeah so my recommendation would like i said for the fourth time by now invest yourself in firearms because like i said the only reason why the government wants firearms taken out of your hands is not <laughs> because the people that are using these guns obviously are getting it through ways in which they shouldn't be getting it 